Hello everyone, I'm Ravana and I'm really happy to be here on another video of the 14 day raw vegan challenge. If you haven't subscribed, you can do that at ravana.com so that you can receive your shopping list and your daily meal plan directly to your email. Okay, as you saw in the previous video, I had my tips for running for beginners. And a really important thing about working out is refueling afterwards. Fruits and vegetables are going to be the best refuel food. Why? Because they're very easily digested by the body, so your body can direct all of that energy into repairing your muscles. Also, remember that fruits and vegetables are so full in essential vitamins, minerals, and even protein, so you really don't have to worry about that. A lot of people question, well, what happens if I'm trying to build muscle? Can I do that on a vegan or raw vegan diet? You can certainly do that. You're gonna be getting the protein that you need. What's gonna build muscle is doing weights and doing more exercise. That's gonna build strength and muscle. So these are my favorite three top um, post-workout smoothies that I really like. Uh, I added greens to all of them, so don't be like alarmed if maybe it won't taste good. They're gonna taste amazing. And remember that greens are really important to eat because they're full of essential minerals like iron, calcium, that we really, really need, especially after working out since we had all of that energy expenditure. Let's start with the first one. For the first one, we're gonna use uh, three to four bananas or five bananas, however you want. We're gonna use one to two pears, one cucumber peeled and cut, and we're also gonna use two to three leaves of romaine lettuce with one and a half cups of coconut water, all right? And you just put all that in the blender and blend it up, and it's ready. All right, for the second smoothie, uh, this one is more acidy, but still is going to really, really refuel all those muscles and that energy. Two cups of orange juice, one or two large apples, and if they're smaller, I recommend that you use even more apples. Two cups of spinach, around four to five leaves of mint. Put that all in the blender, blend it up, and it's ready. Third and final smoothie is one of my absolute favorites, and I really feel that you guys are gonna like it. So, it's gonna be four to five bananas, and I used frozen bananas, two cups of blueberries, and you can also use frozen blueberries, two cups of spinach, three to four dates, pitted dates, and one and a half cups of coconut water. All right, everyone. Well, I really hope you try these smoothies. They're absolutely delicious. They're so easy to whip up after a workout. They're really gonna just put your energy up again so you can keep going, recover, and work out even more. And then you're gonna have so much energy and you're gonna be like me. You're gonna be like, oh, what do I do with so much energy? But it's amazing. <laughs> All right, well, don't forget to like my video if you liked it, subscribe if you haven't subscribed, and I'll see you guys tomorrow for another video of the 14-day Raw Vegan Challenge. Thank you, and I'm so excited for everyone who is participating in it. We're doing this together, it's great. Thank you all for all your love and let me know in the comments below which one of the smoothies you think is better. I, my personal favorite is number one, but let me know, okay? So I'll see you guys later. I'm gonna go drink one of these smoothies. Bye!